This is our model for our side 351 final project. What this machine does is it converts rotational energy to translational energy and then to electrical energy. Underneath here, we have a motor which is a constant effort source. It's tensioned by elastics so that it allows this to apply an even pressure to the wheel. The wheel rotates and is much larger than needed, so it has an inertia. This drives a linkage through a coil, and on the linkage there are five magnets which induce a current in the coil. The linkage is also attached to a spring which acts as a capacitor and pulls the linkage back quickly through the coil generating a high current. In here we have a capacitor. This capacitor delays the voltage that comes from the coil and sends it to an Arduino board. The Arduino board reads the delayed signal in the capacitor and outputs a voltage to an LED and also provides feedback to the motor depending on how high the current is. Here we can see when a high current is produced and the LED flashes high green that there's a slight pause. This is a delay induced by the controller to show that there's a high current being produced and it's moving too fast. Then the controller will slow down the motor for a second and continue on with its revolution.